What's up, YouTubers? Welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's doing well out there. For today's lesson, we're checking out the bridge or instrumental section of Music Never Stopped. So let's go. Cool. So like today's title mentions, today's video is all about the Music Never Stopped. Specifically, the instrumental section that takes place before the riff goes to the A chord, right? The come on children part. Right. So today's goals are that we'll take a look at the chord progression, see what's happening. Take a look at some cool solo ideas we can implement over that, as well as a very cool turnaround that takes you from the E to the A chord towards the end of the progression that John Mayer did in 2017 in the summer tour opener. And then finally, we'll take a look at all of this in context. So let's go. So chord progression wise, it's actually quite simple, especially when we look at how the bass movement is happening, right? Just chromatics. Right? Pure chromatic. Now, when we include the full chords, that's when the fun really starts. A lot of that is essence in F sharp minor, right? And different versions of F sharp minor. Like the first chord, F sharp minor triad in, for, in root position. Root now descends half step low, right? It's almost like a major seven. Minor seven now because this E is the root. flat is the root now to a D minor a E flat diminished E F sharp minor major minor minor 7 E flat as the root Right? And at tempo, a cool thing you can do over that E chord, right? Right, climb up to the major third. Gives that E chord just a bit more of movement, right? Great, 
great, great chord progression. Now let's check out some soloing ideas we can do on top of that. So let's go. So when it comes to soloing now, right, and after knowing this progression, My first inclination, you know, is to go for very A major slash F sharp minor, right? Because that progression mostly has this tonality of F sharp minor, right? So if we do stuff like... Um is really F sharp minor pentatonic mixed with A major, right? All F sharp minor there slash A major. The second time what I'm doing is a descending pattern of four starting from the second degree of A major, right? Right? Again, A major, F sharp minor tonality, very much very similar, right? One more time. important key, especially with that descending pattern of four, is really nailing those notes, right? So one more time, up to there, and then we'll take a look at this John Mayer turnaround lick that occurs over the E chord. So check it out. Again, experiment with this F sharp minor A major tonality because that'll really blend in nicely with this F sharp major, sorry, F sharp minor chord progression. Right? So now we have our bass set, very F sharp minor, A major soloing area. Let's take a look now at this John Mayer turnaround phrase that he does that occurs over these E stabs to get us to A. So check this out. Cool. So let me first play the solo top to bottom with the turnaround. Check it out.
just amazing. That turnaround, I mean, we had to remember, that was spur of the moment, total improvised, and he nailed it first time, tour opener 2017. He's a genius. So that's happening over this E. <laughs> to take us to the A. You could almost call it a one to four turnaround, right? So what he's really doing is sticking mostly in the key of E major. That would be your first part. Part two would be again, E mixolydian. Sliding in from this G to G sharp, hit this D, 15th fret of the B, slide half a step down to C sharp, hit this B, 16th fret of G, then do a major third hammer on 12 to 13 on G. Right? So the first two parts together. One more time. Then we'll descend E minor pentatonic. Takes us to our A chord, right? Let's now include it with the full solo. at tempo. Such a cool turnaround that Mayer does really well where he mixes up the very essence of Garcia's playing and then goes very bluesy like that, right? So now that we have everything down, let's check it out in context. guys that's today's lesson on the music never stopped bridge slash instrumental section right a very cool part of the song we looked at the chords some cool soloing ideas as well as that john mayer turnaround lick to go from the e chord to the a chord that takes you to verse number two you could say right so with all that being said if you enjoyed today's video please leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one